Hey guys. So, all right, well I've arrived and uh, just got off the train from the airport and it took me right to my hotel, which is that one right there, the Stylus. Um, cold, wet, rainy, just like Normandy, right? So, all right, time to get, get checked in. Sorry, I'm a little disheveled. It's been a long travel, uh, travel day. Um, I'm in the hotel and uh, I mean, don't have the greatest view. I mean, it's just a building pretty much out here, but I am on the eighth floor. Uh, the room is, is nice, it's quaint. It's um, it's actually space themed. So you can see the moon there and kind of kind of stylized, pretty neat place. Uh, but here, get this, this is cool. Um, the room keys are made out of wood. It's like a, literally a piece of wood. How cool is that, right? Pretty neat. And uh, while I was at the airport, I saw this and I had to get it. So, um, Mountain Dew in France. That's not the Mountain Dew I'm used to. So I had to get one just to try it out. I know it's just a food coloring thing, but I still thought that was pretty cool. So, um, it looks like I will have one of the other jumpers with me, a guy named Landon. And uh, his uh, hotel isn't working out for him, so he could stay here with me tonight and help me split the cost. But, yeah, again, it's a, it's a quaint little room nice but again it's just for a night just until we can get over to normandy tomorrow so all right well the adventure continues all right so we're at the train station and we uh, oh by the way this is landon and uh so we're gonna actually be heading into paris we got a train ticket and uh let's go see what kind of trouble we can get into in paris Notre Dame. We're here at Cafe Paris. It's a beautiful old school cafe. And we're having lunch. Not even going to try to pronounce it. Mine's a beef meal with potatoes. And yours. What, was, what is yours? <laughs> but anyway, so here's our meal at Cafe Paris. Another landmark while we're in Paris, the uh, Arch of the uh, Arch of Tri uh, Triumph. So, and it was much bigger than I expected it to be. I didn't realize people could go up to the top and walk around on it, but there she is, the Arch of Triumph. All right, still got more to see. Hey guys, well, if you don't know what that is, we're actually at the Eiffel Tower. And uh, it is raining heavily here, so getting very wet. But uh, yeah, we've done a probably a good eight, eight or nine mile trek around uh, Paris, checking out all the sights. So, all right, the adventure continues.
So this is the villa I'll be staying in. And it has a single toilet on the downstairs. That's a little kitchenette. And I'm upstairs. I'm on a sofa sleeper, so let's see what we got up here. All right, looks like this is probably mine right here, so not too bad. There's another bedroom over here, and then we all share a wash area. And a nice looking shower. Okay. So, got TV, a sitting room. And kind of a view of the villa's overall area. All right. Not too shabby. I think I can stay here for a few days. Hey gang. All right, well we're here in St. Maryglis at the famous chapel or church where one of the airborne units got dropped and one of the troopers actually wound up getting hung up on the steeple. So, so, so hopefully you can see him. I'll walk around a little bit. So, so they get the troop actually hung up on the church steeple. Again, this was one of the famous airborne locations. Well, good morning, everybody. It's uh, 4 a.m. here in uh, Normandy, France, and uh, I'm at the villa. So, and as you can see, it is pitch black out. Fairly cool, but clear sky. And uh, getting ready to go do breakfast. And then we're gonna load on a bus after we do a quick equipment check, make sure we've got all of our documentation in check. And then we're gonna get, the bus is gonna then take us to the ferry. The ferry is gonna take us across to England. And then uh, we get over to Duxford. So, all right, we're getting this adventure started. So, all right, see you guys down the lane. Good morning guys. Alright, so we're here at the Victory Museum getting all checked in for our uh, trip over to England for the Cross Channel. So as you can see, we have got ourselves a good sized army here of paratroopers. So, alright guys, the adventure continues. We've got to go get our paperwork cleared and passport cleared. And then we're loading on a bus, getting on a ferry, and then uh, heading on over to England. So, wish us luck. So we're on the ferry, on our way over to England, and uh, we are now underway. Behind me over there, you can see the beaches of Normandy. As you probably know, if you know anything about history, there's a lot of blood spilled on the beaches. So, a little windy out, but we are underway. We're on a ferry, so it's pretty big too. It's almost like a cruise ship. And I think we're gonna be on here for a couple hours getting, making landfall on the other side. So, all right, the adventure continues. All right guys, well, after a very, very, very long ferry ride, quite behind us, not sure how well you can hear me, but there she is. We'll get back down back. It's super, super windy up here. But, Alright, we're on land, back in England, and uh, loading 
up on our buses now. They're going to do a group photo of us in front of the uh, building. They want something for their history books, so we're going to do a photo op for them. And then we're off to Duxford, and uh, that's where we're pizza tonight. I think we have a barbecue tonight, so I'm looking forward to it. All right, you guys, yeah, on the adventure. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and leave a comment. Thank you so much.